I thank God for what happened. It was my salvation. Have you accepted Jesus, Agent Stalin? Do you have faith? I was raised Lutheran. That's not what I asked. This is Special Agent Clarice Starling, 514-3690, deposing Mason R. Verger on March 20th, sworn in a test. Now, I want to tell Mr. you about Berger. summer camp. It was a wonderful child. We can experience. get to that later. So we can I get just... to it now. You see, it all comes to bear. It was a Christian camp my father founded for poor, unfortunate, cast-off little boys and girls who would do it anything for a candy bar. Mr. Berger, I don't need to know about the sex offenses. Oh, I just have to... Right. I have immunity from the U.S. attorneys, and I have immunity from the risen Jesus. And nobody beats the Riz. Had you ever seen Dr. Lecter before the court assigned you to him for therapy? What do you mean? Socially? <laughs> it is what I mean. Yes, if you don't mind talking about it. No, oh, no, not at all. I'm not ashamed. I didn't say you should be. No, we met conventionally. It's doctor and patient. How did he end up at your house? I invited him, of course. To my pied à terre. I came to the door in my nicest come hither outfit. I was concerned. He'd be afraid of me. But it didn't seem to be. Afraid of me. That's almost funny now. <laughs> I showed him my toys, my new setup, among other things. It's a way you sort of hang yourself, but not really. It feels good while you uh well, you know. Anyway, he said, Mason. Mason, would you like a papa? And I said, would I? Um, Wow. Once that kicked in, I was flying. He said, Mason, show me how you smile to gain the confidence of a child. <laughs> I smiled. He said, oh, I see how you do it. The good doctor approached me with a piece of broken mirror. Try this. <laughs> Try peeling off your face. And feeding it to the dog. Seemed like a good idea at the time. 